hey it's great to see you in my video and uh, in this video I'm gonna make a brand new Laravel project and I'm gonna make a simple registration and login process uh, which is a basic authentication in Laravel okay the first thing you should have is the XAMPP uh, which I already have which is already running and you should have composer installed in your laptop or computer um, okay so to create a new project in Laravel you can just write uh, um, Laravel new and the project and the name of the project I have already created this project and then this is a brand new project so let's run this project and see what we have let's go inside to the project directory and run PHP artisan surf and let me open up my browser and this is the output we get okay I have another project running so let me just stop this project and yeah we are here okay so this is the brand new project which I just created right now and I want to create a single uh, a simple um, sign up and login in this project so um, let's open the VS code and zoom it a little bit more to focus on the terminal okay um, so as you see that I run this command php artisan serve and I cannot write anything else in this terminal so I have to create another terminal here new new terminal the next thing we should do is that we have to go inside the project directory and then we have to run composer space require space laravel slash UI press enter this will install laravel UI in our project this will take a few minutes to download the Laravel UI okay so this is successfully done and then we have to write PHP artisan UI space view space dash dash auth press enter okay this is uh, uh, this is also uh, successful and then it says that please run npm install and npm run dev so let's do this one by one let's enter npm install and press enter this will in install the npm in our project okay so we are all done uh, we just have to run one more command npm space run space dev and press enter okay so we have uh, the JavaScript CSS and HTML ready for our authentication and we just have to create uh, MySQL tables in our database so here uh, if we scroll down to our dot env file it says that uh, the project 
the database name is this we can change this uh, my mm, my my db okay so the database name is my db and save this file and open up the uh, php my admin or the sql yog i prefer this software sql yog and then new connection connect to my xam server here we have to create a new database with the same name mydb and create we have no tables in our database right so we have to run the migration for the migration uh, go to the database folder and migration we have three migrations users table passwords and failed jobs table these are by default in laravel so let's run the php artisan migrate php artisan migrate press enter and we will have a uh, error um, which says that the specified key was too long um, this error is because um, we have to do some adjustments in the app service provider dot php which is in the app slash providers folder here um, <coughs> we have to use illuminate um, let's copy this from here illuminate support facets and slash schema okay f a c a d e s slash schema and then uh, in the register function write schema and then default string length and set it to 191 save this file and open up the terminal again clear this mess with CLS so we can we can run the command php artisan migrate fresh okay it worked um, we install laravel view ui and then we uh, installed all the dependencies for html css javascript libraries and then we created a database in our mysql um, mysql server and then we started migration and let's see what we have press f5 to refresh we have five uh, four tables here failed jobs migration uh, password reset and users okay so all the users will go there their name and their uh, password remember token created at updated at here it is default laravel password reset option and here we have all the migrations which run um, with the command php artisan uh, migrate okay so um, what next um, just run and let's see if it is working php artisan um, serve I think it is already running in separate terminal let's close this up yeah it is already running so let's for the safe side let's uh, restart it php artisan serve all right so here we have this project refresh this and you see here we have register and login great let's click on the register it's, it looks like it is working uh, email and password is one two three four five six seven eight one two three four five six seven eight register okay as soon as we register we log in automatically let's log out this and let's check the login I wanna log in with some other account let's see it is working or not yes it is validating our login credentials let's use the same login um, that we used a pacified at their gmail.com one two three four five six seven eight press enter <coughs> here we have we are login uh, okay so uh, let's try one more thing here we have uh, if we go to the login we have this 
forgot your password okay let's uh, check with my email send password reset link hmm okay so that means we have to set up um, the email SMTP server we can do this in a separate video for now we are good with login and sign up okay let's check our database here we have um, let's go to the users table here we have name Ghulam Abbas email abbasified at gmail.com the password is encrypted um, there's one pro tip which I would like to give you that for example if you forget your password you can uh, you can reset the password in Laravel but for a quick reset you can do this uh, go to the bcrypt bcrypt generator.com bcrypt dash generator.com enter any password here I'm gonna write uh, password laptop and then click this hash button we have this uh, be, uh, we have this encrypted format copy this string and then save it in your database okay and then we can log in with our new password this is the fastest way to debug your application to test um, different users I, I used to do this when I forget my password because I don't want to reset my password when I'm developing a project I don't want to reset the password from email when I am developing a project right so we can do this quick from our um, from the bcrypt website let's write the new password LAPTOP laptop press enter great it worked so I logged in with my uh, new password okay so this is it and in the uh, in next videos I will explain more about Laravel this is the easiest way to set up a website or a application and set up the sign up and login process